Okay, we have to check how is this model. Uh, how is this model that we have just estimated? How is this model uh, from the statistical point of view? How is this model? So model from the statistical from the uh, from the statistical right statistical point of view right that we have to check now right okay okay first we check uh, you can see most of the independent variables are significant x3 x5 and x6 are significant so uh, so the most of the independent variables are significant so we are happy about it because because uh, for a good model most of the independent variable should be significant and we have it then I talk about R square it, it is not that high but at the same time not low also but uh, the R square should be around 60% right so but here 43.6% but if the F statistics is significant so that is the good sign F statistics the P value you can see the F statistics of the P value is 0.37% so that is highly significant that means all the independent variables jointly can influence dependent variables okay normally if the R score but if statistics is significant then we are happy about the model because R square actually R square actually within the sample the, the model fit within the sample and F statistics actually model fit within the population so normally what I say if the R square is small but F statistics is significant then uh, normally I accept the result right and here F is significant so I'm happy about the model right although R square is low okay the, uh, then I check the residual analysis I go to view right as before I go to view the residual diagnostic first I check this one test of normality okay what is that uh, this is the Jarkabera statistics and the probability is how much 59.75 percent so we cannot reject null hypothesis meaning that the residuals are normally distributed and 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 the question is that what is our null hypothesis residual are normally distributed and that we cannot reject so we are happy about this model and then talk about residual and diagnostic serial correlation right that I check okay I keep it to lack do I keep it proceed this is uh, Bruce Godfrey LM test and observed R square is 0 0.0 point, uh, 6.83 percent 6.83 percent means uh, it is uh, we cannot reject null hypothesis and, and what is the null hypothesis the, the 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 there is no serial correlation right and we cannot reject it because because observed R square and a corresponding P value is more than 5% we cannot reject null meaning that there is no serial correlation so we are happy about this model then I check the last one the test of heteroscedasticity that I can check the last one 
suppose I choose uh, the brush pregan test right that, that I choose uh, out of many tests okay and here observe uh, test of heterosclerosis right brush pregan Godfrey I choose observed R square here is 82.3 percent meaning that I cannot reject null hypothesis and what is the null there is no heteroscedasticity so this model is good because there is no heteroscedasticity so the model is good because most of the independent variables are significant F statistics is significant and in this model <laughs> there is no serial correlation no heteroscedasticity and the residuals are normally distributed the only problem that r square is slightly low but 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 as the f statistics is significant so the model is all right so far thank you very much for being with me for a while So this is the uh, terms of usage, right, of this model.